DJ, because of a tragedy, she's a widow on the show, is now single. And um, Steve, of course, is being very tactful and respectful, but he wants he wants to uh, see where things go with DJ. So, and then and then as far as uh, my relationship with Candace, I mean, we're still we're great friends. We're great friends. And um, her husband is an amazing guy. We hang out together all the time. And um, they, um, you know, I was at their wedding 20 years ago. And I mean, it's it, the cool thing is, is that we've stayed friends all these years. It wasn't like we had this big reunion. It, it, it's, a, it's a reunion on the show, but it's not a reunion for us because everybody stayed so close. And yeah, so it's, it's cool. And, and, by, and the fact that the show exists gave us another opportunity to hang out, which I love. We're, all, it's, we're, we're really enjoying it. Everything about it was weird. Everything. I mean, acting again was weird. Being back on that set again. I guess the secret's out. It's the original set is back up. The original couch where I told DJ I loved her is back. The the couch, not like a repro. I mean, every you know, being together with those guys, it was. Uh, and then the weirdest thing of all was how not weird it was after the first day of of the looking around and feeling very confused. It was like 20 years hadn't happened. We were all just hanging out, making the same old jokes, and going to get lunch. And it was really. A, it was an unusual experience that not many people get to have. It was great. I, I was worried because acting isn't really my career right now. I'm, I'm a full-time TV writer and TV producer. And I, my, my biggest concern was that I wouldn't be able to leave work and do this. And it just worked out perfectly that I got to do both. I was so happy and relieved.